and welcome to today's tip. Now, as you can see, it's going to be on Halloween. So what I've done is I've got out all of my letters from my stash from every different collection possible. It doesn't matter that they're different colors. So just grab all of your old letters and we're gonna use them today to make a fantastic mixed media layout. Now, I've chosen my letters here. They're all from a different kit, like I said, and I've just placed them on um, some cardstock. You are gonna need quite thick cardstock for this. Now, I'm just gonna put them aside and I'm just gonna show you how I mix up. This is um, PVA glue, okay? So I'm just gonna put a big blob in the middle. The first thing that we're going to do, I'm just gonna get all of that PVA glue and I'm just going to wash out my background where I'm going to place my letters. I'm just gonna very loosely where those letters kind of were and then I'm going to just start sticking them down. Okay, as you can see, I have put them down. I've kind of mixed them up because whilst the color will be lost, you will still see the patterns underneath and some of the different shades of color. So what we're gonna do now is I'm going to add a little bit of, this is a beautiful, it's called, I think it's a liquid acrylic, free flow. This is a magenta and it's absolutely gorgeous. I'm gonna add a little bit more of the glue and I'm just gonna mix that up and see how that comes up. Okay, and then all I'm going to do is just paint over the top. And this can be really, really scrappy. It doesn't have to be anything special because don't worry, it'll all come together together at the end. Now I recommend before the next section dries, what we're going to do is we're going to get a paper towel and we're just going to rub off some of that excess paint. And as you can see, it kind of lightens it, but it also brings out those letters so much more. Okay, so I have layered that all up with the paint mixed with the PVA glue and a little bit of water. And then I have used my kitchen paper just to pull off quite a lot of that paint. Now there's some areas for me that don't stick out. I love the darker letters, but the lighter letters have got lost under that thicker paint. So I'm just going to experiment here with using a bit of black um, paint and just bringing out some of those letters. There we go, so a true mixed medium background for us here. Now just to finish it off I thought I might do a nice bright um, Halloween title using more of my letters that I've got here. So I think I'm gonna put my photo on the corner here. This isn't a Halloween photo but it's kind of all I've got just to show you at the moment. So this is a really simple easy way to use up some of your letters that you may have and from different kits. That's the beautiful thing about this tip. You could just use any any kit, because let's face it, we've all got loads of leftovers. So there's a little fun layout, a mixed media layout for you to do today. I'm sure you've got some acrylic paints and some PVA glue and some old letters in your stash. So I hope you've enjoyed this tip and I will see you next time.